I haven't introduced myself in a long time. My name is Julie. I'm a professional makeup artist, a licensed hairstylist. I'm 51 years old. And today I'm gonna show you how I cut my bangs. I know that I need a haircut when I wear it up all the time. You're gonna need a couple of clips. Part it where you would normally part it. In my case, I just part it down the center. So what you're gonna do is you're going to lay your comb like this. Look at the comb right here is where it touches. So that's as far back as I'm gonna go. So I take my comb, I'm putting my thumb right here and I'm gonna connect there. I'm gonna put my thumb there and connect the two. Comb that out of the way. These just started bugging me, so I don't wanna cut them too short. What I'm gonna do is pull it down and then I'm gonna twist and twist again. What that does is ensures that the outside edges are actually longer than the center. So what I normally do is I stretch it out past my nose because you know it's gonna bounce up and usually I will put my garbage can here. <laughs> so I'm just gonna cut straight across. So when I comb this out, you're gonna see that this is longer than this. You see, so it already goes like this. So I wanna layer this now. I'm taking this section right here and I'm gonna pull it straight from the head, but at like a 45 degree angle, okay? So there's my shortest piece. Now I'm gonna cut this off, okay? So I'm still at the length that I had it originally, but the internal hair is now layered. These pieces are now shorter. Then I'm gonna take a part of what I've already cut and the rest of the hair. Remember, I want this all longer, so I'm gonna over direct it to the center. And then, where's my shortest piece? My shortest piece is about there, and then cut that. Okay, same thing. I'm going to pull it out, over direct. There's my shortest piece, and then cut, and add the rest in. Remember, you can always go shorter. So there's my shortest piece. There's a little bit right there. So I'm gonna blow this out and see where it lands. All right, I feel like this is landing exactly where I need it to. I can always go a little bit shorter if I want to. If, if I do want to, I'm just gonna do the same steps over again, just little bits at a time until it sits properly. You can also cut it dry. Oftentimes I do, and that really allows you to see where it's gonna bounce and be safe with your cut. So I hope this helps and I will see you later. Bye.